This is Foxman, the number one solos player in Chapter 5. Less than one week into the season, he has 54 wins, over 1.2 thousand elims, and a KD ratio of over 15. He's also notoriously dropped in over 50 elim wins. Now he's done most of this in solos, and he has probably the best exponential settings I've ever seen. And I'm going to use these settings myself in solos to see if I can drop a massive 20 bomb win like he does. But before I play solos, I'm actually going to play a game with Foxman. Alright, let's see the settings that we'll both be playing on. So we're going to start off with the slide hold time all the way down as low as it can go. And of course, like every good controller player, we have vibrations turned off to help with the aim. As far as quick weapon goes, literally no pro players are using this. And honestly, I don't think anyone's going to start using this either. It's not that good. For the sensitivity, we do of course have use advanced options turned on, and then both his build and edit multipliers are 2.2. And that's multiplying his look sense of 43% on horizontal, just a tad bit higher at 45% on vertical. Foxman doesn't use any boost on his look sense. He actually doesn't use any boost at all because his ADS sense is 10% on both horizontal and vertical with, again, no boost. Zero second look damage time, and like I said, these are actually exponential settings. I'd say Foxman and Reet have the two best exponential settings oh in the game, but the way Foxman God, yeah. plays, it doesn't even look like he's on exponential, but he still gets the benefits of the aim. Because if you didn't know, it's quite a bit easier to aim on exponential. It usually just makes the builds and edits feel worse, but I don't think that's the case with these settings. Then on his dead zone, he actually also uses this controller. It's called the Scuff and Vision. And so he's using 7% on left stick and 8% on right stick. Now, I have one of the best solo players in my lobby. So while we're getting a win, let's get some tips from him on how he's able to be so good in Chapter 5. I literally just got up. They even just said something about how they're going to bring back OG Fortnite again, but it's not going to be in like the same way. Dude, I hope, I hope they bring back Chapter 2. I'm dead, baby. There's one. We get to watch him work in, in real time. I don't know. Look at that. The reason why it's so good, so like if you compare it to like the pump, like the time that it takes after an edit to shoot the pump, like even if you're trying to shoot as fast as possible, versus this. Oh yeah, it's way faster. Yeah. You can instantly make an edit, shoot, and then reset, and before the pump can even shoot, you could have the wall reset. The kid near his teammates not. Hit one of these kids 60. Need to find a med kit. There's a team on right. that mountain kind of far away from us. Be careful. Coming to you. Wow, I just might be the best. I saw that. The little under piece there. Killed one. Nice. Come back to me. 110 on that guy. Oh, they got changed around. No way. I actually just sold. The one kid's low. Brute gunner. Nice. 110. 110 on the other. Nice. Kill them. Taking this kid's box. One kid left Carter 2k. I put up six. You put up 16. I wish I could like grab him, bring him in. I'll take the snipe. W. Yo, Foxman, GG. Now I know some of the key parts to winning in chapter five, so I'm gonna test these settings in my own solos game. And I'm not gonna lie, it's been a while since I've won a solos match, so let's try to do this. Look, I'm just not built to land lavish layer by myself, so. We'll rotate over and get the medallions later. If you didn't know, me and Foxman are both actually PC players that just plug in controllers. And both of our PCs are actually from Paradox Custom. Our team Zen sent them to us and they're actually amazing. It's part of what allows us, or at least Foxman, to be really good. They built PCs for huge people like Clicks, Justin Bieber, The Weeknd, and tons more athletes. Like if there's a famous person with a gaming PC, Paradox Customs probably built it. So if you're in need of an upgrade from a console or even a bad PC, Check the link in the description to build your custom PC. And if you use code ZEN at checkout, you actually get a discount. Alright, now let's win this game. Always take some AI kills.
I mean, bro, on Expo, you can just jump into people's boxes with your AR like that. It kind of works. Maybe not the best strap, but... Can't say it doesn't work. Oh my god, I forgot you could do that. Nice. Bro, it's just so hard to fight these medallion players. Like, as soon as I engage with this guy, I'll be fighting the rest of the game. But if I don't fight them, then someone with the medallion will end up getting, like, four of them. I think this dude already has two. And at that point, it's like an impossible fight. Bang, I got a medallion, let's go. Like, bro, people are way too bold with these things. That guy didn't even build. Bro, why did I just take fall damage? Like, holy, bro. pick up like four bills like bro these guys got it i just never have maths to fight i mean settings got me to second place i guess well shout out to foxman make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed it. and thank you so much for watching